All right, so there's like this sneak peek for my adventures with Superman season two. Uh, I really love the first season. It's honestly my, f like this is honestly my favorite iteration of Superman. I absolutely adored what they did with this because I don't know, growing up, I, I feel like I've never really been exposed to <laughs> like, we'll say like accurate representations of Superman because it's like, the first ever Superman thing that I ever watched was Man of Steel when I was like 13. And I liked Man of Steel, but you know, it's, it's not, it's not Superman, you know, it's very much Zack Snyder doing his own thing. And then like, I watched some of Smallville and it's like, it's not really Superman. That's just like a prequel story. And I didn't even finish it. So I don't think I ever even got to whenever he went to Metropolis or whatever it happens in the later seasons. Um, and so, like, I, yeah, I don't know. Like, I just never really watched the original Christopher Reeve Superman. I've never read any of the comics. I will say I did watch... I think I've seen, like, a couple episodes of the animated series. But when by the time I got to this, I like, I, I started watching the season one of My Adventures with Superman. I was like, oh, I think I understand now why people like Superman. Because I absolutely fell in love with the Clark and Lois dynamic. I was like, oh, they... Yeah, they're supposed to have chemistry, right? <laughs> that makes that makes sense, right? Like I'm supposed to believe that uh that Lois Lane likes Superman, right? Cuz obviously Henry Cavill and Amy Adams have zero chemistry. <laughs> no no fucking neurons firing in that chemistry lab kit. Um and it's like, "Oh, Jimmy, you're alive." You're not dead. Wow, that's I actually like you as a character. So I don't know. I just I absolutely fell in love with my adventures with Superman season one. Um, so yeah, let's check this out. It's only thirty seconds, so I don't think there's gonna be too much here, but we will watch it. Hello, Revenge. There is another like you. We are running out of time. What is that? Uh, Zod? No, not Zod. His like real dad. I'm forgetting though. I think yeah. Yeah, he he does he does like see the 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 projection of his the computer version of his real dad. But I thought it was a weird thing where like he couldn't understand what he was saying. I'm trying to remember. Did did they get to the point where Clark could understand what his dad was saying? Jor-El, I think is his name. Russell Crowe. <laughs> there is another Revere needs you. I have no idea what this bro is, what bro is saying, and they don't have subtitles, so. There is another. It is what it is. We are running out of time. Is that it? <laughs> I guess that's it. Well. Wow, what a great sneak peek. I mean, I feel like this is just teasing Zod, right? Hold on. Hello. There is another like There is another like you. Although this looks like this might be a woman. What it is... So maybe it's not Zod? Or maybe this is just somebody that needs Clark? Maybe this is like Supergirl or something. Jor-El is going like, hey, your your cousin is coming. She's late. She was supposed to take care of you as a baby. But now she needs you as an adult. I don't know. I legitimately have no idea what he's saying at the beginning of this. Hello. <laughs> what is he saying? Hold on. Is it? Does somebody in the comments know? Uh... Zod or Supergirl in season two? Uh, I don't think anybody's like translating what he says at the beginning. I don't know if I'm deaf, so you guys can let me know if I'm just not, if, if I'm just deaf. Um, I'll try one more time. Hello, Revenge. I'm hearing like Kalel Revere needs you. I I don't know, but yeah, I think 
It kind of seems like this is maybe Supergirl. I think this is Supergirl, actually. Um, and I think he's telling Clark that Supergirl needs him or something. Which is which is kind of interesting. Because that's, like, different, right? Because Supergirl, I think, usually just crash lands on Earth. Maybe in this version, uh, Supergirl is just out in space doing stuff, maybe? Um, and Clark has to go out to help her. So we'll see. Uh, but yeah, listen, I'm, I, don't, I don't really care um, that this is like a super short teaser. Literally only 10 seconds. They Adult Swim is being cheeky with the runtime <laughs> and this weird like subscribe thing. Um, yeah, I'm absolutely hyped for this. Uh, I will. I, I love the first season, so I'll definitely be, be watching this when it comes out. Um, and yeah, let me know what your theories are. What do you think was going on with that? Translate the beginning for me if you're <laughs> if you're able to. Um, and yeah, just let me know what your thoughts are on the show overall and if you're excited for season two. And uh, also subscribe if you don't mind. Like the video, why don't you? Uh, that'd, that'd be nice if, if, you, if you could just show a little bit of class. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.